the main menu, click on Reports. Under this heading, click on the Reports icon. This will bring up a menu with all the results from previously given quizzes. Select the name of the quiz that you wish to view and in the bottom left corner, under Create Report, click on the Report icon. In this new menu, we can select and view the students' results in various formats for either the entire class or each individual's grade. Along the left-hand side, we can choose which individual we would like to view reports for, or we can select all for the entire class. For this exercise, let's look at the entire class. In order to do this, let's click inside the Select All box. For a simple grade sheet, double-click Student Response Result. This will give you the results of each student for the quiz. Student response result will show the results for each individual student. In addition, it will show the questions with the chosen and correct answers. Question report and class response report display the student's answers for each question. Question report displays every individual answer. Class Response Report displays what percentage of the class chose the different answer options. Study Guide is a great report to hand to your students to study for a future test that will cover the same material. This report keeps track of which questions were answered incorrectly and lists them for the individual student. Lastly, Absentee Report displays which students in the class are absent during the quiz session or who did not participate by logging in. This is a nice way to keep track of your attendance in your class. Finally, all of these reports can be exported into different formats, such as Microsoft Excel, a Word document, PDF, HTML, and a CSV file. If you are using a different gradebook program to manage your grades, you can convert any report into an Excel file so you can transfer your data into your personal grade program. In order to do this, open a report that you would like to export. In the upper left corner of the window, click the Export Report icon. Select the location of where you wish to save the file, then select the format of which you would like to save this report as. In order to finish, click Save. For some more ideas on how you can use QClick to make your classroom even more efficient, check out our next set of videos.